All-Star Wrestling Network uses trained professional athletes for the performance you are about to watch. Do not try this at home. Welcome to another exciting episode of AWN. Oh, we got the syndicate thrown up on the banner. We got Caleb Scott being accompanied by his tag team partner, Paul Wolf. We got me on commentary. To my left, we have a, uh, another special guest commentator. She was out here last week for the uh, Joe Kim Memorial Cup. We got Angelique Gardner. How are you doing, Angelique? Hey, I'm doing pretty good. I, You know, I'm pro AWN. I respect that. They've been around here for about 14 years and, you know, they made a name for themselves here in the state of Georgia. So I respect Team AWN. I can see what Team Syndicate's trying to do. Trying to bring uh, this new hotness out here. Damn it, Jinx. But after, you know, the, uh, the repercussions. I don't know what the repercussions are of the whole stuff Marshall situation with the George Kevin Memorial Cup. Yeah, I know. And they came out and beat him up and everything. That was horrible. It was just horrible. Much disrespect. I'm still upset about that. Well, we got a newcomer coming out here. Oh yeah, I've heard some good things about this guy. I've heard a thing too. Uh, that he's over in um, China. Daniel! It should be an interesting match. We got a man that he's an MMA fighter by uh, by trade. He's made a transition over to uh, professional wrestling. He watches on Fight TV and says, hey, I want to give this a shot. Let's go out there and see what I can do. Right. So here he is, Jerome Daniels, making his first time appearance. The fans seem to be digging him. I think if he stays here in the States instead of going back over, he'd be a great addition to AWN. That's right. Well, he's taking on a team syndicate in the form of Damage Inc. Yep. It is a one-on-one -on -one match, but you got Paul Wolf out there. They're not the, uh, the nicest of guys. And this match is almost like two against one because you know how Dammy Jenkins. And then if eight, and then if those syndicate guys, a bunch of them come out, then it's even more against poor Daniel. That's right. I don't know if Daniel knows what he's getting his, getting into. I'm sure he's watching the show. He's fight, we're on Fight TV every Friday night. We're here live the second, fourth Friday of every month. So he's probably got his homework. He knows what to expect. He's watching his back. He's watching out for Paul Wolf. He's watching out for Sour Naro. He's going to try to prove himself out here at AWN. Mm -hmm. First lockup of the night. And look, look. Oh! Friendly, friendly chops there. It hurts! Face it up and over. Off the ropes. Duck in the clothesline. Oh, nice! Nice! Drag another deep arm drag. There we go. Look, beat that guy up. The third one, and he's holding it this time. Go for an arm bar. He's trying to end it quick. Oh, come on, come on, come on, Daniel. Fighting out of it. Oh, look, he has some strong legs. Look how he is holding him. Got a modified triangle hold, but he was uh, Kill Scout was holding up to the ropes. Couldn't tell Paul Wolf was helping him. Oh, look, what are they? They're probably out there scheming and everything like that. You know how they are. Plotting and scheming. All right, time to fly. Oh. Jerome Daniels. And he lands on his feet. There's Jerome Daniels coming in, making his presence known. Oh, that's right. Right in that ear. Oh. Fist to the face. Oh, the ref didn't see it. Drove, is the ref temporarily blinded? The ref is just... But he came over there and he cheated, grabbed it and put it down. Well, ref slipping. Well, let's go out to Matt. We got some great matches coming up after this. We got uh, 
Brock Proctor Johnson coming out, and we got a big Georgia Junior Heavyweight Championship in our main event match with Doc Anthony and Marvelous Michael Stevens, so we're forward to that. That's right. And guess what? Here, not too many places do this. Kids that are 10 and under are free. Did you know that? I didn't know that. Yeah. So come out here the second and fourth Friday of every month. Kids that are under are free. You heard it from the boss man's lady. Or the boss lady, I guess you would say. You know, you kind of... We had discussions with Dave. He's not here right now. He knows his place. Now, you're a veteran, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah, that's right. And um, did you know veterans are only uh, five dollars? Only five dollars? Yeah. I'll have to pay to get in because you know I got to do work. Got to do commentary. I got to do the announcing. Bit of a renaissance man. Oh, did you see that? The ref had his back turned, and Paul Wolf came over there and was choking him. He needed to hook the leg right there with that cover. Paul Wolf. Working on Jerome Daniels. Uh, it's Caleb Scott. Oh, excuse me. Caleb, they, they blur together. <laughs> they blur together. They're like one person, right? Quinn Magic. Come on. There you go. There you go. All right, Daniels. See him kick out of that? He has to win this. We need a win. Teach these boys a lesson. Ooh. Jerome Davis hasn't picked the shirt. He hasn't picked the team. He's just fighting to prove himself. Oh, that was a nice. That was a clothesline, right? It's a clothesline. Break it off the seed. Punch your way out of it. How many times can they hit him in the head before it's called? You know? He's got five seconds of punching. I hope Daniels doesn't have a concussion from that. He's going to be a tough guy. Like I said, he came from the MMA world. Made the transition. He's holding on to the ropes. Oh, he's hitting it. It's Paul Wolf now. Come now, where's the ref? It's right. Come on, Paul Wolf. You're slipping. I told you it was two against one. Two on one match. It could be more. You never know wherever the rest of the team syndicate is lurking about. I think Caleb Scott let him have that one. Because he probably let him get up so he could beat him up some more. That's like well within his repertoire of things that he does. That with the chin lock. He has some pretty good there too. He does he's trying to get the uh, the fans behind him. Oh look, okay, look, the fans are cheering for him to give him some strength. That's right, and he's feeling it. He's making his presence known, like I said earlier. I've seen that in a lot of matches. Go for a back body drop, back foot lands on his feet. Oh, there you go. And Zaguri. This could be what he needs, what he has to do to turn him, this match around. In a lot of matches, the good guy gets cheered for, and that gives him energy to push through. That's what's happening right now. Both men down, rep counting. What's Paul doing on the outside there? Is he gonna? Oh, he's cheering on his guy. Cheering on his guy, getting him in strength. Oh, oh, I think Daniels has found his thing. He said, "Come on." Send him your energy. Hands up. Uh, I'd say that was a nice uppercut there. From... Oh. Yeah, Haymaker action going on from Jerome Daniels. Back and forth, back and forth. Somebody's elbow to the temple. And he's laid out. That could be it for Caleb Scott. Daniels on fire. Sure is. Okay, let's see what's going to happen. Off the rope. Oh, nice. Big power slide from Jerome Daniels. That could be it. Oh, that should have been. That could have been three. Look at that. His hand was millimeters off the ring. Oh, that should have been three. Oh, listen to the crowd. A-W-S. Yep. So coast to coast. Nobody home. But he slowed down and caught the big boot. Hey, Caleb Scott is. Oh, there we go. Kick up. Caleb Scott is a good contender, though. I'm telling you. He's. Uh, represents his brand pretty well. Represents Team Syndicate. Represents his tag team, Damage Day. I wish we could bring him over to AWM. Show him the right way. You know? I'm sure if you asked him, he'd be more than willing to listen. Oh, I doubt it. There was Sal. Come on now. Off of a green shirt. Let's see what happens. Maybe he just needs the opportunity, you know, a chance to grow. Ripcord knee. 
Oh, look at this. What, what's going to happen? It's like a big move here. Fisherman suplex into Noshi Garoshi. A what? Oshi Garoshi. Yeah! All right! Woo! Daniel! Daniel's won! That is awesome! Awesome, awesome. Right, put those boys in their place. Well, Daniel's with the win.